YouTube, I thought about doing a very quick unboxing video for my newest uh, Twispy fountain pen. I'm a huge Twispy fan. Most of my fountain pens are Twispy fountain pens. This is the mini. This, these are the Echo fountain pens that are currently in use. I use them in different notebooks for different purposes. This, for example, is in my wallet slash TN. It's the mini vac fountain pen again at Wispy. In my experience, they write beautifully and that's why I love these pens. I do love the fact that oh, you can see your ink in there. I love this idea. They carry quite a lot of ink in uh, one pen. So there is no need to use a cartridge or a, con a converter because it's a piston filling fountain pen. I'm gonna put all the information in the description box below. So here it is. Then straight away you have a couple of information sheets. Another information sheet. This is about the increasing uh, aspect of the pen. Maintenance aspect of it. And here is the beautiful... I do love green-blue colors and that's why I was so excited to see this coming out. Here is the beautiful pen. And this is my very first Twispy uh, pen with the uh, bold nib size. That's what it's called in their website. They do have this tub as well, which is one size bigger than this one And when it, when it comes to writing. Uh, but most of my Twispy fountain pens are either extra fine or medium. Majority are extra fine and few are medium. I have a, a purpose for this one. I told myself that I'm going to use it in my gratitude journal along with my classic Twispy fountain pen. This has the medium uh, size nib. Most of the days I find myself writing a lot in one page. Uh, but some days I won't have a lot to say. There, there will just be a couple of things that I want to say. Here is where I'll be using this pen. I wasn't sure if it was gonna fit in my uh, uh, pen uh, holder, but I'm glad that it does fit because it's really useful since I don't have a pen loop or uh, any space here to carry my one pen. Now there are two, so this will be very helpful. I'm gonna fill it up with this ink. Well, what you have to do to fill it up is that you have to bring the piston all the way up here until the end and then you just dip it here and you bring it back up and when you do that you have that filled with ink for me to get uh, more ink in the way i do it is that you do the same process again and i find that this does uh, ensure you having more ink in your pen. I'm not sure if you can tell. There is more ink than the first time I tried. So I cleaned the pen up now. A little bit of a writing test. Uh, the font is definitely thicker than my, the rest of my Twispy nibs, so I'm happy for that. It's good for a change. That's all for this video. Thank you all for watching and have a wonderful day.